Hello Cancers, welcome to Cheeky Spiritual Guide. This is going to be your love reading for June 6th through the 12th. We're going to take a look at your love life, what's happening, the person who's on your heart and on your mind, what's going on. So yeah, alright, if you are new or returning to my channel, welcome and thank you. I appreciate your presence. I hope you all are doing very well. Life is good to you and you are good to life. This is for the sign of Cancer, June 6th through the 12th. All right, one more shuffle. Okay, so the underlying energy here is a two of wands. We're going to go deep into that. We're going to see what that's all about. You have the Empress and you have the Ace of Wands. All right. Taurus, Libra, Ace of Wands, Two of Wands. So either you or a love interest are making a decision in your life. You're at this crossroads where you're trying to decide what path to take. All right. So Cancers, this could be you or your partner. Let's see. Clarify this Two of Wands. There's the Empress again. Uh... Oops, excuse me. <laughs> um, the Empress. This could be Taurus, Libra, or this is growth. This is you deciding which path to take as far as expansion goes, evolution, growing, moving forward, moving on up. Why is the Empress here? Yeah, that's what it is. Because you, my love are kind of bored right now you're not really feeling it like you need some excitement some enthusiasm you know what i'm saying and you're like hmm what do i want to do which way do i go what's the energy of that two of wands oh there's the five of swords with the knight of wands five of swords with the knight of wands i mean are you this is kind of giving me defeated energy. It's like, it's almost like whatever way you go, it's not going to be a win-win for you. That's what I'm kind of getting. Like you feel like you're going to lose something no matter what path you take. I know that's very vague, but I, nothing specific has come out. It's just telling me what you're feeling right now. So let's come back, possibly, if this doesn't give us enough clarity. Why is the Empress here? Why is the Empress here still? Standing up for what you believe in. Fighting for something. Um... Why the seven of wands? Are you fighting for something? Guarding something? Why the seven of wands? Thank you. Hmm. This is interesting. Hold on. Clarify the ace of wands, please. So you have the king of swords with the hermit ace of wands king of swords aquarius libra gemini virgo energy the hermit it feels like you're trying to why the lovers reverse sorry i'm I, uh, i'm not it's not all the way clear to me but Clear, hold on, clarify the lovers reverse. If you're, are you separated from someone? Yeah, that's what it feels like. Like, I feel like there's a relationship you want to grow with, right? You want to expand, you want to take it to the next level but you guys are in a separation, right? And because you're in a separation, 
it it feel, makes you feel a little bit more defeated than you would if you were together, right? Because now there's a whole new obstacle. There's a whole new thing in the way. But I feel like you want to fight for it. I feel like you want to put energy and time into this connection to make it what you feel like it's worth. Like, you feel like it's abundant. You feel like, you know, we could rule the world. Um... I see the desire, I see the passion here, and I think you're just trying to figure it out. You know, you're going within, you're gathering your strength, you're you're trying to make do be wise, I feel. What is the energy of that that uh what is the energy of the empress? The fool. Ooh. Like I just want to just go for it. Just take this leap of faith. But doing let's see why the fool yeah the ace of cups that's what i'm saying like let's just start over let's just make this happen what is the energy of the ace of wands the ace of swords having truthful clear i think you know what you want but how to get it is where you get a little bit stuck. So what do you need to know about this person, though? Because obviously, I feel like the separation is what's stopping you from moving forward, from growing, from evolving with this person. Um, what does Cancer need to know about this person that they're with, this love interest? What does Cancer need to know, Spirit? Okay. Well, they're kind of juggling. They're like, you know, have too many things going on in their mind. Uh, probably, I don't know, this could be tangible things as well. They have things they're trying to balance out. Why the Two of Pentacles? If you are wondering if they're coming around or why they haven't or something, I think it's because they are kind of like trying to find their own balance right now. Maybe they're overwhelmed with things or thoughts or feelings. It just seems like they're trying to do too much at once. Why the Queen of Wands reverse? Yeah, there's that stuck energy. Um, Feeling trapped. Trying to get out of this, whatever they're in. What's the energy of the two of pentacles? Ace of cups. Starting this new connection, new love, new relationship. Whether that's with you or just in general. Maybe they want love too, but mm, they have too much going on. Just maybe emotional fulfillment. So what do you need to know about them? I feel like they're going through something. They're juggling a lot of different things. Okay, they're not in a stable place. Even mentally, I feel like they're just, they're just not. Not with the Eight of Swords, they aren't. Okay? Um, and I just, with the Queen of Wands reverse, I'm just getting this feeling of overwhelmed. Feeling, maybe even some jealousy. I'm getting... Um, yeah, jealousy... Uh, sorry, the word just escaped me. Anyway, that's kind of their energy. So what happens next in love for you? What happens next in love for cancer? What happens next in love for cancer? Okay. Oh, okay. Get the Ace of Cups. Okay, but you have the Page of Pentacles reverse. Um, this new start in love is it's it's a little delayed. Okay, it's not there's there's no progress right now. Um, yeah, let's find out why the Page of Pentacles reverse.
There's a lack of process, pro, sorry, progress. The Nine of Cups. Why the Nine of Cups? Um, someone could be indulging themselves in pleasurable, fun, happy stuff. <laughs> um, and that's That could be you. That could be your partner. Just take it how it resonates. But I feel like some it's because someone is hesitant. All right. I can feel them pushing against like a new beginning. I, I think this is your person. All right. Because this, this delay or this lack of progress, I feel like it's because of them. Because they have a lot going on. They were juggling multiple things. And they were very overwhelmed. So I'm not surprised. I wouldn't be surprised if they were um self medicating or like i said going out overindulging in things clarify this ace of cups the two of cups why the two of cups unless this is something completely different two separate messages because this is about finding new love right you making you're making a connection with someone the five of pentacles like maybe you you revive a situation it could be this person i don't know it, i'm getting two completely like polar opposite things where there is a delay but then there's new love right um spirit what is the energy of this page of pentacles reverse yeah no this is something else so you you may meet someone or this could be like a completely different person what is the energy of the ace of cups oh I, okay this is nice energy um it's like you're recovering right from this situation i feel like new love comes in right while you're like recovering while you're removing the shackles from that connection, um, like an, an old flame or someone, I just get a revival here. Or it could just be after, you know, you've done most of your healing. Why the five of pentacles reverse? Let me just make sure because, oh, king of wands. Do you know a king of wands? Aries, Leo, Sag, doesn't have to be a male. Um, could be, you know, a, a woman or a man. Um, yeah, like if you guys have been a separate and apart, you've been independent of one, of one another, like this person could come back around, you know, and try to revive this situation. All right, so what is your advice? So that's what happens next. So you could have new love. I, okay, I dig it. Somebody could come back around. Alrighty. So what advice do you have for cancer, spirit? What advice do you have for cancer? Oh, the emperor. Three of cups. Um. Alright, so... I'm going to start with the three of cups because that's the simpler one. Um, <coughs> the three of cups is telling you to go have fun, Cancer. Go get with your friends, your family, people you love, people who love you, people you have fun with, and go have some fun. Go enjoy yourself, okay? Laugh, party, um, you know, I... I think it takes your focus off, right, of this situation. Because this is focusing on the fun, focusing on the good things, the good time. Okay, we're going to clarify just to get more information, but that's what I get. Now with the emperor as your advice... <sighs> There's, there's something you have to take heed to, okay? Now, that could be, I mean, are you feeling like you 
don't have structure or stability? Um, are you feeling powerless? Because the emperor showing up tells me that that could be a possibility for you. So let's clarify. Why is the emperor the advice for cancer? The temperance. Doing things in moderation, staying calm, being patient even. Why the temperance? Yeah, the Ace of Wands with the Ten of Wands. I think sometimes we don't realize how much power we have. How we are like the writers of our own story. Um, you know, we take authority over what happens some most most of the time you know there are things out of our control but we're not talking about those i feel like you i feel like you need to take control over your life that's what i feel over what happens over the direction you go in um like you have you have uh what is it you have a creative control excuse me okay and i think that's why the emperor is showing up all right, like taking taking advantage of your power in your life, like you using it, making things happen. Clarify this three of cups, please. The two of wands. Yeah, yeah, cancer. Go focus on fun, all right? Because I think you're so, you're contemplating, you're thinking about, you know, what paths to take, what to do, you're in just this decision making mode and you know sometimes when i get this nine of pentacles it feels like go spoil yourself <laughs> go spend a little bit of money um all right go buy you uh, something that makes you feel good go to one of those very luxury spas and do something really nice for yourself okay go treat your friends you know to dinner or like something i don't know something like that something that's gonna make you feel really good okay that is what i'm getting for your advice my loves i hope this was helpful i'm gonna stop here um good luck with this don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will talk to you guys next time Mwah. deuces